Natural roofing materials offer some of the best aesthetics and performance out there among all roofing materials. However, depending on where you live, there are some strings attached to buying natural materials that you need to know about before doing so. That's what we're covering in this video today. I'm Brandon Hayfley with Bill Reagan Roofing Company, and thank you so much for watching the Roofing Channel. Let's dive in. They don't have a manufacturer's warranty. When you buy a natural roof material, it hasn't been created, it's simply been shaped. Because of that, it does not come with any form of a manufacturer's warranty, even if the manufacturer did shape that product. Now, for those of you who don't know, manufacturer's warranties in roofing will cover any defects with something like shingles cracking and shriveling up after only a few years of installation, when in reality, they should last a lot longer than that. Manufacturer's warranties will typically last anywhere from 10 years to all the way up to 50 years. But since they can't really predict any defects that happen in natural materials, that's why they don't have it. What this means is that if any issues happen to the materials themselves, such as a cedar shake shingle curling or a slate roof cracking, it means you have to pay out of pocket to get it fixed. Now, if any installation issues occur, such as the shingles falling off of the roof, then the installation warranty should cover that, and that's provided by your roofing contractor. That's why it's extremely important to have some kind of workmanship warranty attached to your natural material roof. Otherwise, you have absolutely no protection. Their price can fluctuate. Natural materials do come from the earth and they are in limited supply, which is one of the reasons why their price can heavily fluctuate. If there's a shortage or some kind of problem in the mines or otherwise other places where they're produced, then you could see the price spike up for a temporary amount of time. Likewise, if it's in abundance, you could see the price go down for a temporary amount of time. But what can really make a roofing material fluctuate in price is something that we're all too familiar with in this post-pandemic world, and that is the dreaded supply chain issue. Natural resources are only able to be produced in certain locations, and they have to go through a lot of different steps of a long process to eventually end up on your roof. So when one of those steps goes wrong, that's when you can see the roof start to skyrocket in price, especially if it's in high demand. Any roofer who specializes or installs these roofing materials is going to be able to inform you if it's a bad time to buy those products. They keep track of the supplier's prices, so when those supplier's prices spike, they'll be able to let you know, as long as they're reputable. There are artificial counterparts. The two main things we just listed are the main cons that are attached with every natural roofing material. Now, some homeowners find themselves in a lucky spot to where the price might be down and they're not dissuaded by the other factors that go with it. However, there does exist a chance that a homeowner might need a roof right now and the prices are very high and especially those prices could be higher to afford that long workmanship warranty to cover their natural roof. For the latter type of homeowner, we would highly advise looking into the artificial counterparts for some of the best natural roof materials like synthetic slate and synthetic cedar shake shingles. These materials come with their own full list of pros and cons. They are their own unique roofing material and they're only designed to mimic slate and cedar shake in aesthetics only. So if aesthetics are the number one thing you're concerned about, we would highly advise doing plenty of research on it as it's going to be a lot more stable and a lot more mass produced than those natural materials. If you're looking for more details on those artificial counterparts, then we would highly advise you to click on the link below or at the end of this video where we give you a link on the pros and cons of synthetic roof materials. I'm Brandon Hayfley with Bill Reagan Roofing Company and thank you so much for watching the roofing channel. If you feel like we helped you out a little bit today, consider liking this video and dropping a subscribe for the roofing channel. It really helps us out so we can spread more helpful information to homeowners just like yourself. And I'll see you next time.